Well, the bike is okay. <clears throat> I recommend the uh, self-sealing tubes from Canadian Tire, actually. <clears throat> I can't believe it. I don't know how I just lost all the air. Luckily, there's enough to like ride back. I had 10 or 15 kilometers ride back. I thought I was gonna have to sleep under a bridge for sure. Still suck. But yeah, self sealing tires. I don't know what happened. I don't know. Can you just lose a bunch of air for no reason? I don't know. Maybe I rolled the tire. I don't know what happened. But I guess I'm riding on like self sealed puncture or something. I looked at the tire, there's nothing. Party, Hindu party over there. Either that or the trees speaking or speaking Hindu. But yeah. Just an update. The tire is okay. I can't believe it. I thought for sure I was going to have to buy a new tube. Filled it and still going good. Unless it's like a four, three day leak, but I don't think so. It's not losing any pressure at all. So I guess it worked. I didn't expect the self seal to actually work. I really gotta get a bike pump. Jeez. Oh, it's gonna rain. So I'm shutting it down early today. Tomorrow might be a long trip. Just taking one day rest, I guess. I still did probably. Probably like 60, 70 kilometers in the city though. Maybe. Yeah, at least 60. At least 60. Oh, oh. oh brake almost didn't work there. So it's messy with my brake. Soon will be the trip to Vancouver. I'll be excited. I'm basically in training for that. I think I can definitely do it now. I can do a hundred and some kilometers, no problem, in a day. I just need a comfortable way to sleep on the in the bush. And I'm good to go. Oh, uh, I have to check my map. I don't know which way I'm going here. All right. 